Welcome to Cave Crawler. Cave Crawler is a pretty bizarre title for me to play because I am terrified of caves. The idea of crawling through a tight space makes my sphincter and I'm terrified of playing horror games by myself. So what could possibly go wrong? After acquiring mining rights to the area in 1992, Rockwell Mining Group was alerted by local park and forest services to a missing persons report near the entrance. The following footage showcases the use of Cave Crawler, a newly patented survey oh i'm a drone huh huh this game kind of reminds me of a 3d duskers it was one of the really cool indie game that came out freaking years ago probably about six or seven years ago now where you're a drone controller except now we're playing the drone and that game was terrifying for for a top-down text-based game that game was about as scary as you could get hey nice how do i my thing's yellow what do I do? Okay, I'm going to assume there's no button for picking up. All right. What was that? Hello? Hello? Is anybody there? Okay, so as far as I'm aware, we're currently searching for a missing blood. D. Okay, can we not? Okay, we can't go in there. There's like a hole there? Weird. All right, well, I guess we go the other way. All right, let's go. Hello? You know, we don't actually know how big this drone is. It's gotta be a pretty small drone. I mean, look at the size of this flashlight, which means that this lady person, I actually don't know if it's male or female, who came into this cave by some genius idea of their own, decided that I would go into a cave by myself, crawling on my hands and knees to get through the spiky undergrowth. I don't get cave divers. Yo, I, you know what? I don't get more than cave divers. Cave divers are terrifying enough. Free divers are a different flavor of completely insane. If you don't know, free divers are the, a group of people who don't take scuba tanks with them when they're diving into the ocean. They explore caves with just the oxygens in their lungs. That is psychopathic in my opinion. I could never do that. Oh, hello. Oh, it's just a rock. Never mind. I thought, oh, no, no, no. Why is it's a backpack? Okay, are we? No, there's nothing there. Can't get across the bridge. A, a, a bridge? What the hell am I talking about? Can't get across the chasm. Hello? Ah! What? Huh? What? Motion? Huh? Where did I detect motion? I didn't see anything. Hello? It's fine. Yeah, I'm sure it's fine. <laughs> That's fine. You know, we're just detecting motion behind me permanently. There's a little spider hanging onto my back that, that I'm detecting the motion of and never finding. <laughs> <sighs> oh, that reminds me of uh, Aphotic Descent. It was one of the games I played a while ago. If you haven't seen that, by the way, definitely go watch that video. That game, that, that video was pretty fun. But it had an anglerfish. It looks like an anglerfish's mouth with all that <laughs> going on. Once again, my voice acting is simply sublime. <laughs> that mouth needs googly eyes. You're not wrong, Ribbon. And you know what? I'm gonna use that as an opportunity to promote my Patreon! There are patrons right now watching me record this live! And me laughing at Ribbon's joke that's gonna make it to the video was because of that! You know, this game would be even creepier if you were like a human, and from a human's perspective or a person's perspective, you're watching like putting your hands in front of each other and your light kept flickering and dust was falling around you. Being a robot, I feel invincible. Like nothing can hurt a robot. I'm just that awesome. Oh my God. This whole time there's a scan button that I'm not using. That's why my rat kill is going yellow. It's like, hey, you should probably scan this. It's probably very important. God damn it, dude. <laughs> I swear to Christ. I swear to God. Dang it. Baba ding, baba doom. Unauthorized excavation. <gasps> How dare they? When I find the dead body, I'm going to get their ID and sue their wife. Ma'am, I'm afraid your husband is dead. Also, that will be $100,000 for the unauthorized excavation. Thank you. Bing. Zero DNA detected. My man didn't have athlete's foot. Well, that's one thing he had going for him before he died. Isolate Tiger's bag. Contents unknown. 
Stop screaming at me! I am innocent! Until proven guilty! That's the American way. And as a robot, I have no rights. <laughs> oh, sh- What the hell is this? <gasps> oh, shit! What the hell is that? Is that a butt? I think we found the person. I think we found the body. You found the missing- Yay! I did it! I wasn't scared at all! After testing the cave crawler for approximately four hours, it was able to locate the missing hiker's body in a cave containing a crystalline structure. After further study, RMG discovered the crystals are highly dense energy source, rivaling the output of current day nuclear energy sources. After discovering a new potential fuel source, RMG required deeper exploration to locate additional crystal deposits for further testing. I love going deeper. The following footage was collected by cave crawler 22 hours after a major cave and trapped RMG mining personnel within the cave. Oh great, guess who's back in the cave? Find the bodies three. All right, it appears the, the kill count of this cave is going up? Rockwell excavation container. So is this blood or is this like remnants of the crystal that they were harvesting then? Rockwell mining tool, human. Oh, that's not good. Okay, so is there is there a creature causing this, or is the crystal causing? Like, is there is there some voodoo stuff going on here? I I don't know. <gasps> oh oh shit! Flashlight? No helmet. There is. What is that? There's a dead guy up there. Why is there a dead guy up there? How did he get up there? Why is he up there? I found a body. Nope. Nope. All right, job done. Nope. Nope. We're out. We're out. We're never coming back. Infinite power? Well, it's not worth dying over. I'm getting the hell out of here. Yeah! <laughs> Fuck this place. This place sucks. There's some demons going on down here. If I learn anything from the movies, if you see a dead body suddenly fly away, that thing gon' gon' get eaten, and you're next. Fuck that. <laughs> Fuck that shit. I'm out. <laughs> Bullshit! <laughs> I, don't, I don't care who you are, that's some bullshit! Oh, you know what this reminds me of? It kind of reminds me of hives. You know like ant hills and stuff, how they have all those little tunnels and then a big chamber in the center for the queen. So like there's all these tunnels and there's like creatures crawling around and they're feeding the queen. And these crystals are their poopy. I am a biologist. I am a scientist. What was that? Did I just see a body? Okay, yeah, no, we're fine. We're fine. We're definitely not leading hundreds of thousands of man-eating termites to the surface. Oh, okay, here we go. All right. Can we get some rips for Jesus Christ? The crystal is growing out of his face. I I am. <laughs> Bad things aren't happening right now. Nope. It's all good. It's all good, man. <laughs> Cavern blocked. Cause unknown. Hmm. I wonder if it has anything to do with a giant fucking rock. No, couldn't possibly be that. It's a base blocked for no apparent reason. There is no physical reason for, oh, there he is. Okay, what is? There's like something growing on that crystal underneath him. Do you see that? Like a little red pustule. Oh! I did it. <laughs> After searching for two hours, the cave crawler was only able to locate the bodies of three of the miners still intact, alongside personal equipment of the remaining 12? But further examination of covered bodies provide important medical data on the crystalline structures. Beginning as small spores, once contact has been made with a form of biological material, the crystals will begin to grow by converting the biological matter into energy. 
After implantation, small crystal information f appearing within 24 hours, with crystals reaching full matru maturation after 48 hours. Is this going to be a thing where we take one of these crystals and put it in like a poor country and harvest it? it is, surely that's not something a corporation would ever do, right? Beginning at 0800 hours, seismic detectors registered a slow buildup in vibrations deep within the RMG pit. After two localized seismic events, contact was lost with the feeding team. The cave callers deployed to look at the missing team member. Yes, a feeding team. That couldn't possibly go horribly wrong. Wearing a mask is highly recommended, but not m mandated. It's not mandated? We're not responsible for any medical issues. I mean, I would suspect the ability to infect the entire freaking planet with a crystal that grows in biological matter would cause you to mandate the use of a mask. But hey, maybe I'm the crazy person. <laughs> we all know that's not true, right? <laughs> oh, we're back here. Wait, no, this is different. There's water now. Intriguing. Oh, oh my, what the fuck? Unknown liquid. Okay. I'm sorry. Why am I hallucinating? I meant to be a robot. What is that? Uh... A mistake? Wait, okay. Okay then. A mistake. In indeed, that. I, I can confirm. That looks like a mistake. Oh! <gasps> what is that? What is that? What is that? What is that? Oh. Oh, that's bad. You found a crystal. Mate, that's not a crystal. That's a man. Damn, that, that per. Motion detected? Where? Hello? Oh my god! They were feeding them humans! I knew it! Those packages, those parcels are dead humans! There are no bodies left, only the crystals. Bro! Why do corporations do this shit every time? Uh, hey, it only needs biological matter. What should we bring down here? Should we bring down a cow? Well, looks like Ted's going first. <laughs> he found a crystal. Yay. I like how they're not counting these as uh, the missing team, which means that these people that they are feeding to the crystals aren't the team that was involved with feeding them to the crystals. No. There are even more dead people somewhere in this cavern. I love how deeper into this cavern we go, the more disturbing and flesh-like these cave walls are becoming. Like, that's messed up. <laughs> there is something terrible happening here. Oh, here we are at the border of the unknown again. Look at this. Oh, oh, there's something down there. Un... Oh, look at that. What is that? Unknown organic. Mass? That's huge! Uh-uh. We're finding another planet. I'm moving to Mars. The Earth is doomed. I am done. I am done. Screw this place. <laughs> Musk, take all my money. Take it all. I am leaving. Oh, found it, found it. Here it is. Oh, that took a little bit of searching. Jesus Christ, this cave is too creepy to be spending this much time in it. Uh-oh. <laughs> Warning! Federal law provides severe civil and criminal penalties for the unauthorized reproduction, distribution, or exhibition of copyright motion pictures, videotapes, or video discs. The following footage is for internal use only. Unauthorized use may result in major fines and slash or penalty of up to 65 years. The following footage was collected from Rockwell Mining Group after the results of agents redacted and redacted investigation into the origin of the earthquake. RMG was immediately subpoenaed for further documentation regarding the records of the mining site. Upon review, the following footage is believed to be what caused the disaster. Are those arms? What the hell happened? Oh, I don't like this. This is nasty. My little robot buddy's infected. Why is my objective? What does this mean? What the hell happened here? 
Oh, shit. That's a lot of spores. That's a lot of spores. Okay. Oh, those are huge. Look at the size of those. Oh, look at the size of that. Multiple bodies. That... Oh, sh um. Yeah, that's, yep. That's fine. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. <laughs> Everything is fine. Yep. Nothing to be concerned about here. Undulating intestinal track. Dude, I'm not cut out to be a scientist. I, I can't handle this shit. This is messed up. Carlos. Carlos? Gabriel G. All right. William F. Well, I have to pay respects to that guy. Mario L. Uh, that guy took a fat L, didn't he? What? Oh, this is some grave mind level shit, dude. What the? Is that an eye? Look at this. Is that a freaking eyeball? No, no, there's no way. What is that? Wait, what is that? of the provided materials and under the order of the current director of Homeland Security, RNG has been contracted to continue study. Nuke it! Nuke it! Build a giant wall around it and nuke it! Every single nuke piled up in that cave, all of them, boom! Problem solved! And that was the nightmare fuel that was Cave Crawler. Oh my god, that was an absolute nightmare. Please rewind the tape. Uh, sure. All right, and that's where I'm going to leave off for today. If you want some more content, I have plenty of stuff on the channel for you to watch. Or if you want to go watch someone absolutely hilarious, Tear of Grace has been pumping out content on the new terrible Gollum game. You will not regret watching it. I am rolling around laughing whenever I watch that. Thank you all so much for watching. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.